I'm Rabbi Matt Rutta. I am the director of Jewish Student Life for Hillos of North Texas. My pronouns are he, him. I'm originally from Los Angeles, California. Oh, we have tons of events. Um, I think we may potentially be the most active group on campus, much to the chagrin of the union because we keep scheduling events like two to three times a week. Almost every single one of our events involves some sort of free food, whether it's a Shabbat dinner, whether it's a bagel schmooze, whether it's pretty much anything we do will involve some sort of food. We had uh, an archeology span um, Israel dig that we did last week, which was really cool. Um, and we have a bagel schmooze today where we are going to be eating bagels and schmoozing, which is the Yiddish word for kind of just talking. Um, we have Shabbat services and dinners every few weeks. We have holiday celebrations coming up. There's always something to do at Hillel. One other thing that we do with Hillel, and this is, I think, one of the coolest things you can do, is birthright. We take students to Israel on a free trip to experience the, um, our ancestral homeland and to walk in the steps of our ancestors, to be in the land of the Bible, the land that our ancestors and even the us have you know, cried for and prayed for for millennia and spend 10 days journeying around that land on a bus with their peers and eating the most incredible foods and seeing the most incredible, both meaningful sites like the Western Wall and touching those stones and kissing those stones and tasting the saltiness of the limestone, but also I think the saltiness of our ancestors' tears, such a powerful thing. But also, you know, going ATVing on, um, in the Galil or going to haggle in an open air market in Tel Aviv to try to get challah covers for a cheaper price. I, I think it's something that is so incredibly important because I think many people don't understand Israel. And I think that if people understood it more, both through education, such as we're gonna be doing during Israel week and different events, but also actually going to Israel and walking in those footsteps and realizing, hmm, maybe it's not as it's portrayed by the media. Maybe there's more to it. Maybe it's a little more nuanced. I wanna learn more. Judaism is about being nice to other people, is about realizing that your neighbor has the same blood that you do. And if you're not seeing them as a fellow human being, you're doing it wrong. And so what I really want people to see is that Jews are human beings. Christians are human beings. Muslims are human beings. Buddhists are human beings. Hindus are human beings. If you are any religion or if you're no religion, as long as you are committing yourself to a good life of seeing other human beings as human beings, then that's the most important thing. So if I were to leave you with anything about what Judaism is, it's that. It's be a good person, and then the rest can come later. But this is the starting point. The rest is just commentary. Now go and learn it.